Hey everybody and welcome to my channel. I am doing for you a um, advice reading for Twin Flames and Separation. I realized after I uh, posted my video last night that I forgot to pull your guys' advice cards. So I am going to um, just do a full spread. First card will be your energy up to this point. The second card is your advice from spirit. And the third card is the outcome if that advice is followed. So we will get started right away here. I want to thank you guys all for coming to my channel. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. Um, you have definitely been a blessing to my life. So I just wanted you guys to know that. All right. So energy up to this point with you and your twin, who you are now in separation or partial separation from. Okay. One more. Wow. Wow. The Altar Priestess. This card is one of two cards in this whole deck um, of the Wisdom of Hidden Realms by Colette Barrett-Reed is my Twin Flame card. So what this is telling me is um, a lot of you have been doing the work, have been putting in the time and the preparation that it's going to take for you to call in and manifest this relationship again. Um, it's asking you to um, keep saying your prayers, keep saying your, um, your meditations, your mantras, um, and continue to prepare for this union because, um, with this full moon in Gemini, uh, that we are having on Friday, we're going to be at zero degrees Gemini on the 23rd. This full moon is going to bring in answers, clarity, whether you're talking to them or not, things are just going to be cleared for you that you're going to be able to see what's been going on and why everything had to happen within, you know, starting even today, tomorrow, all the way through three or four days past Friday. So, um, things are starting to, uh, become clear. The path is being lit for you and it's saying to you to, um, prepare, pray and perform a sacred Ritual on Friday um, is the strongest day. You can do it a couple days before and after. Um, Friday, I will be doing a live uh, feed uh, with the full moon um, for Twin Flame uh, uh, ritual. So if you are so inclined, please join me. And, um, and you can perform that with me as well. So what is... Spirit's advice. Um, your advice is high, the high lady of love and compassion, reverence, kindness, and consideration. So um, what Spirit is advising you to do is to really be patient with your twin that you are in separation from. Consider what everything that they are going through. Consider the changes that they have to make. Consider um, their feelings in all this. For a lot of them, they're uprooting their whole life, everything they've ever known to take this leap of faith. And it's not always so easy for everybody to jump right in, um, especially if they're an earth or an air sign. Um, they're having a lot of trouble with that. Water, um, they go on emotions. So, that, you know, they're, they're first to jump in and follow their heart. Fire signs are all action. Go now, think later. So they move very quickly into um, jumping into new situations. Where earth and air, they overthink. And they um, do precise moves. So um, just treat them with kindness. Uh, I know it's hard because sometimes you're just so, ir or not irritated, but frustrated because things aren't moving along as quickly as you'd like. But just uh, remember to consider everything that they're changing, everything that they are transforming from and into um, because they are coming for you. It's just, it's not always so easy for everybody. So, um, be patient, be compassionate. And, uh, and when you do that, they will come forward very quickly. <clears throat> All right. Your outcome. Oh, we got more than one. Your, uh, outcome. If you follow this advice is the cosmos creativity and vastness. And I love how Colette Barrett Reed describes this card. So I'm going to go ahead and read out the book for this one. Um, it says the cosmos appears always as an ally and never as a challenger. 
Creativity in all forms is represented by the cosmos. This is a sign to place your intention on creative projects. They will be successful. Remember that all life is creative and you're always co-creative with the divine. The cosmos also represents the principle of infinity and the vastness of the energetic exchange of consciousness influencing all living things. This teaches us that every intention we set is, in fact, contagious and the power to influence others. We're entangling our deepest energetic place, so we can't help but have an effect on others, from an individual level to a global one. This is a sign to remind you to open up the well of creativity deep within you and be mindful of your thoughts and actions. Both are influencing your outer world. Most important, keep taking action towards your goals, as the cosmos responds perfectly to manifest your highest destiny. Expect to be inspired and to meaningfully touch others with all that you create. So um, to me, this is your guys' soul's purpose. Uh, when you come together with your twin, you guys are here for a reason. You're here to um, accomplish something. And that is what's going to happen. If, if you take the time to um, be considerate of all things going on, be patient with them, allow them to come to you in your their own time. But in that time, it's time to do a sacred ritual. It's time to manifest. It's time to call that person in so the universe knows exactly what you want. And if this doesn't just perfectly flow together, I don't know what does. So um, I hope you guys join me Friday night. Um, it'll be uh, Friday at 5 p.m. Central U.S. Standard Time. So um, I hope you guys can join me. And uh, I will be going, or I'm sorry, did I say five? I meant, I meant eight. I'm sorry. Um, I was thinking in my head I had an appointment at five. So I had to put a shit back further than that. So I will be here uh, live at eight o'clock to uh, just go through a sacred ritual that I do. Um, it's the my favorite one that I have found. And we will uh, call in our twin flame energy if that's what you're wanting. Um, it's really anything that it doesn't have to be a twin flame or a soulmate. You could um, you can ask for many things. Dream big because your dreams are about to come true. So Twin Flames, I hope you enjoyed your um, advice reading. And I'm sorry I didn't have it at the end of the reading last night. I totally forgot about it by the time I got done blabbing. So once again, thank you guys for joining me. God bless.